Speaking of donations, let me get a cheap plug in there. Um, I am doing uh, Extra Life. Uh, this is not an Extra Life stream, but uh, any donations are, are still welcome. I actually got a $53 donation the other day. I am 97, nice. $97 away from hitting that mark uh, for the $1,000 oh, mark for the gold medal. I have six more days to accept donations, or really seven days, because today's just starting up. Um, if you're on Twitch and you go into the About section of my channel, you hit the, uh, you go down, you click on the picture that says Donate. It'll take you to my Extra Life page. If you want to donate, it's greatly appreciated. A dollar goes a long way. And um, we got to get Rose that gold medal, man. Come on. Donations are tax deductible when you file your taxes. Uh, accepted from the United States and Canada. Uh, Extra Life UK is its own thing, so. We don't accept their donations, uh, unfortunately. Um, uh, what better, you know? I could, I can only think of, I can't think of, you know, a better gift than to give, give these kids, you know, the gift of a better life for Christmas. That's the way I see it. Damn, you plug that shit good. Now you make me want to donate. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm cheap as hell. <laughs> see, hey, that's that's what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to make you feel like giving up your money. <laughs> but see, and and that's the thing, man. Like. For the kids, man, a lot of people, a lot of people, honestly, will donate, and, and 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 you know what? That's that's good. Like, if anyone, if any organization, because me, like I said, I'm I'm a cheap I'm a cheap motherfucker. That's that's like 100 percent true. But if there is any organization that I would I I would loan my money to as a donation, it will be anything for like kids, Saint Jude, Extra Life, all that shit, man. For the children, you feel me? Yeah. Uh, all like I said, a dollar goes a long way, man. And uh, any amount you want to give is greatly appreciated. Uh, if you can't donate, your uh, you know if you could spread the word at least, it'd be greatly appreciated. Um, but the first ROM hack I have set up for the Christmas occasion is called Super Mario World Christmas Edition. So if I patch this correctly, this should be there. It is. We got Christmas Mario, baby. Mario. <laughs> Mario. Oh, that's so cool! They they this person like reworked the Super Mario theme into Jingle Bells. Oh no oh, shit! Cool. Yeah, it's got to lower the volume just a little bit more. Um, let me see. Put it down to thirty uh, percent. Yep, there we go. Yeah, so I'll let I'll let you guys listen to it for a moment. Uh, those of you on the stream. You can totally hear it. If you're listening into it, you can hear it. You know, it dips in and out of Jingle Bells and into the uh, main Mario theme. <clears throat> uh, we're going to play this one. These are relatively short hacks, so... Uh, story is, welcome, it's Christmas, but an evil ice princess wants to steal your presents. Hurry up, your friends are waiting for you. What fucking evil ice so princess. princess? What is this fucking so, um, adventure time over here? Is the princess is the heel this time? <laughs> oh shit, you know what? My fucking. Uh, oh, okay, my screen. I thought my screen was cut off, but it's not. Alright, so we I are gonna be, play. I'm gonna be in a hentai porn with a beautiful <laughs> ice princess. Beautiful evil ice princess. So I'm gonna just tell you. Children. I'm just gonna tell you guys right now. I'm gonna use safe states because, like, I don't have time to play these games legit. I got like three or four of these to play, so um, if I die, just pretend like it didn't happen. <laughs> uh, big coins, yeah, yeah. Big coins. See, hey Ray, I was playing the original Mario Brothers on the Switch. Uh huh. Oh, and... see, that, that death. Pretend it didn't happen. <laughs> and, uh, I finally beat it for once, but I used what the Switch Ply does. Uh, I, I either use save states or I rewind the game. Oh yeah, you so, asked me this on my Extra Life stream, Casey. He wanted to know if you would consider beating the game like that cheating. For using save states <laughs> and rewinds. No, that is definitely cheating. Like, if you wanna, if you wanna say you completely beat a game, you have to do it like 100% on your own, man. You have to go through every mission. No, no rewinding. No, no, that's, that, that is cheap. 
Well, the thing is that they planned it, so I'm like, it, it's, it's all right. I'm like, it's not like it's like I hacked it or made it the reverse, the rewind it. I, it's in the game now. So, uh, and they have save states. I mean, is save states cheating? Man, I mean, yeah, no, because I can't get behind you saying they supplied it. Okay, I can't get behind that. Damn, but Conoco, like, you're unemployed again, bro. What the fuck happened to you this time? <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen, that six hundred dollars severance package they're supposed to be sending out. Listen, yeah. that should help a little that, bit. Um, I heard they're yeah, not sending what? it. I heard they're not sending it out now because Trump wants two thousand dollar checks. And the yeah, government told no, him yeah, no. I heard that too. That's not gonna happen. Yeah, the government told him no, so apparently now we're not getting any checks. Man, fuck well, it. well, I mean, listen, I can't disagree with the man. I mean, two thousand. See, that's that. That could be debate, but at least at least give us the twelve. Like we got the first go round. Because there's yeah, people, some people out there do need it. You feel me? Oh, exactly. People, not, now, granted, not everybody. Needs but there's a good handful oh. of people out there who legitimately do need that money. So, yeah. twelve I think they should. Listen, they can listen. They can fucking spare that shit if you ask me. Yeah, now, I think the people who really needs it should get the two grand, and uh, people who who really don't need the money, who's being employed right now, shouldn't get anything right now. You know. Right. But, yeah, people whose benefits haven't changed, like. Their working status. I, I see. Yeah. I was even saying that the first go round. Like, if their your working status hasn't changed, you shouldn't receive that. If your monthly your your income status hasn't changed, you shouldn't be receiving that. But exactly. you know what? Listen, if it's coming my way, I'm taking that shit. So <laughs> I, I agree. Can, I mean, I'm in the same boat. To. I'm in the same boat. I was like, if they send it to me, I'll take it. I know what Casey would do with his. <laughs> well, I actually said the sentence. To Drew, it's like Drew. Uh, I can't wait for my PlayStation Five money to come in. I know, I know, that's what you'd do. It you'd buy, you would rush out there and you'd buy the most P, the expensive PS Five you can find. Oh no, no, fuck that! I still, I'll try to hold on to that money for that. Like you, I was you, you'll go, up. you'll go to Vintage Stock and you'll buy that fucking. Seven hundred fifty dollar deal, and you have to buy the two games on top of that and the extra controller. <laughs> well, actually, now someone already bought all those, so uh, unless they get more, I hadn't seen them in the wild now. Oh, and I should I should say too that in this game uh, level, there are secret exits to some of these levels. I'm not going to go looking for them. Normally, I would, but I don't got that kind of time. Yo, but up? right now, I'm holding out. I mean, I got my PS4 Pro. That's only like, I feel like it's only a half step behind the PS5. Honestly, I'm fine with my PS4. As long as they make games for it, I'm good. I so, agree. I'm not, I'm I mean, not even complaining about that. I just gotta have a PS5 by the time Gran Turismo 7 comes out. Because that's not coming out on PS4. I just have to have a PS5 when fucking Grand Theft Auto 6 comes out. Yeah, you got. Well, if that's the case, you have about three more years. <laughs> exactly. That's what I'm going they on. they because they did say a few months ago that uh, GTA 6 will be like somewhere around uh, no no sooner than sometime before 2023 or some shit. I believe. It. I believe it. Which honestly is very scary because they're yeah, not. And this level's got a lot of fucking slowdown. Hold on. Doing... It, that's oh, gonna I make fun. GTA 5 a 10 year game. Yeah. But see, wow. they're, not, they're not doing anything good with Red Dead Redemption 2. Which yeah, they gave up on that game seemingly. And, and they want to put all their attention and focus on GTA Online. I, I done got tired of it. I got freaking ten million dollars in GTA Online. I don't want to spend my shit. Like I don't want to do any more heists. Like fuck all that shit. So did, I'm play did, some Red did, Dead, did you do the new heist that came out or no? I the last the last update that I participated in, meaning that I thoroughly sat there, played, and enjoyed, 
was the casino heist. I mean, not the casino heist, the actual opening of the casino. Oh, okay. So I didn't do the casino heist. I didn't do um, this heist. And honestly, I, I really haven't been doing anything, honestly, with that game. Besides going to the casino, doing a few of the VIP or CEO work missions. That's it. I just like going on there to shoot people. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> I was like going down there shooting people. <laughs> oh, you know what? I got a question for you guys. Since the rise of the battle, why it Royale, are we gonna have that in GTA probably in the future? Oh, you mean like Fortnite, like um, um, or PUBG? Yeah, like Fortnite no, or that would be fire. That would be fire as hell. Cause they can do I, it. Yeah, I just thought about that. I was like. I mean, I'm surprised they ain't doing that right now, quite frankly. Damn, Conoco, that sucks, bro. You just seem like they always have the shit end of the stick when it comes to fucking, uh, fucking jobs, man. At one point, he did work for the government, though, so. <laughs> oh, good shit. Uh, I want to shout out Frank, uh, Frank from the Harsh Truth, uh, with a donation. Uh, I'm trying to see. I am at, uh... He gave a thirty dollar donation. Much appreciated. Oh, nice. Sitting out that, that dude, man. That puts me at uh, sixty sixty seven dollars to hit that thousand dollar mark. We can, okay, get, we can get at is it. This, uh, is this gold medal? Is this gonna be a real gold medal or is yes, this it's a, a digital? Yes, it, no, it's a real gold medal. I, I won't get to claim it. Broken freaking neck. I won't get to um. I won't get to claim it though until uh, January, like two weeks into the new year, because they want to. They make it official. Uh, they make it official by making sure all the money's counted and whatnot. So. Right. But yeah, I already I already have the silver medal because you get that one at five hundred dollars. Are you going to um, do a, another extra live stream before uh, your, your time's up? Nah, I think because, ne like, um, my mom's on vacation uh, next week for the first time in, like, fucking six years. So I think uh -huh. I want to spend, you know, some more time with my, you know, my family, so. I figured, hey, this is the, you know, I'll make this my, my last push. Um, I know my dad said he was going to donate some, uh... My dad was going to donate something he's going to give to me on Christmas, actually. So, okay. Uh, I, I, I don't exactly know how much that is, but I'll find out tomorrow. But, uh, see, Frank, see, I, I, I appreciate the I donation, no, bro. It means a lot. I had no problem donating for something like this. It's one of those... Um, you know how, like, the WWE, they had that... Was that the... Coleman, the, uh, Su G. Susan, Susan G. Coleman, and you know yeah. what? The money they raise for that, first of all, they only give like a, a small percentage of it to the actual company, and well, I, and not only I, that, but um, it's only to raise awareness. It actually doesn't, it actually doesn't really help. You know, it actually really doesn't help the actual like finding a cure for for the breast cancer. The problem is, you're, they're never going to find the cure. <laughs> I mean, I hate to say that, but it hey, seems like... Look at this to Casey, like, fucking burying breast cancer patients. Like, wow. Wow. You, just, you, you just went freaking heel right now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you say that, man. Well, Dang. I'm just saying, like... Honestly, it's kind of like the money's into the... The disease, they're not gonna actually find the cure. I mean, I want to say a cure. Wow. <laughs> Frank says, War to dash a million um, women hopes. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, wait, wait until we fucking <laughs> unleash that shit on Sunday. Oh <laughs> man, you're gonna get no, fucking I'm just married. That I, look, <laughs> I felt like I believe in these kind of um, charities than Su Susan G. Coleman. I mean, I, I believe in the Red Cross, and but some of the I other ones... Oh, really? Red Cross, yeah. I heard Red Cross say like that. 
They don't, they don't, they only, like you said, basically the same, same thing as Susan G. Komen, but they just give a small uh, percentage of money to like, uh, uh, what the fuck is it called? Reform projects, if, that, if that's the word I'm looking for. So, they only give small money to the cause, basically. Well, I'll put it this way. If I didn't think Extra Life was a good cause, I wouldn't have been doing it for seven years. Absolutely, absolutely. And, and like you said, man, anything with motherfucking children, man. But that's the line. Hits me in the heart, man. Yeah. I mean, the first time I ever heard about it recently was that Jake DeMarco and when, uh... Well, me and him, funny enough, me and him started doing it in the same year. We just didn't even know each other back then. <laughs> And Jake missed, Jake missed two years because of his health. Otherwise, yeah, otherwise he would have did seven years too. He, that guy just keeps getting in, getting the short end of the stick of the health. I mean, he gets, he gets better and then he gets worse. I mean, God, I feel bad for the dude. I uh, hope he has a good Christmas. I, I invited him to be on the stream tonight, but I guess he's doing his thing with Joe, so... Man, yes. you know, um, what the what disease is that? Um, or not disease, but there was an organization. Damn, my brain just shitted itself right now. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot exactly what I was gonna say. Anyway, one of y'all, one of y'all talk. My brain just shitted itself, man. <laughs> TSS says Casey is heel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I'm. Probably wasn't the smartest thing I ever said. I'm just saying it's just I just don't see it ever getting a cure. I mean, I honestly I do want cure for breast cancer and shoot, like my dad passed away from colon cancer. So obviously, uh, I want there to be a cure for cancer. But shit, we can't even get the cure for the common cold. <laughs> You know, okay, I just remember what I was gonna say. So, one of my English teachers from high school, real sweet, real sweet, really sweet. Like, she had a heart of gold type of sweet. I thought you were gonna say she had a heart attack. I was gonna be like, whoa! (laughs) (laughs) Listen, a moment ago, a moment ago, I thought Casey said his dad, or was going to say rather, his dad died of breast cancer. (laughs) <laughs> Which is wrong. Men, men can get breast cancer too, apparently. So really? Like, it, no, they can't. They can't. Can wow. Well. I'm not 100. I mean, no, I'm pretty confident on that. So I heard that a bunch of times, but mostly it's women. But men can get it too. Um, but this teacher, she was sweet as hell. She had a heart of gold, right? And it was around, I want to say, winter time, because that's when they usually start showing the um. The, the pet charity commercials, you know, like the uh, ASPCA or whatever the fuck it's called. It, it, it's just like, because those commercials are long as fuck. I, I oh, fuck so yeah. Yeah, and, and and you get them on YouTube play. videos too. You once know, in a I while. Haven't seen, I haven't even seen any. Well, I probably will now since you said that. But, <laughs> um, <laughs> commercials are long as and you know they play that sad music. One year they're playing the Arms yep. of an Angel song. Man. Yep, Listen, yep, I remember it, those commercials. It's heartful. And she was like, man, you know, I hate, I hate it when those commercials come on. Man, I just want to pull out my wallet and donate. It's, it's so sad. I'm like, well, there's one one simple solution to that. Change the channel. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> okay. Jesus don't worry. Christ. You, you, said some, you said some holy shit tonight, but I think that was holy. And don't feel bad. I said that at least in front of like 30 to 35 people, so. <laughs> like, well, I'm, really saying, I'm kind of saying, bro. I'm like, I'm really like, sick, though, man. because I, I see those commercials. Like, man, I don't want to sit here for three minutes and watch this shit. I want to get back to my program. So I'm just exactly. fucking channel. <laughs> what? Hey, like, right, 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 right. Do me a favor. Go stuff. find your teacher. Go find your high school teacher and give her another reason to want to donate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not as I'm not as convinced against those commercials, man. But <laughs> listen, I might start showing freaking. Never mind. I ain't gonna say that's fucked up. But it's just <laughs> listen, oh, that was some cold shit. I said I ain't gonna lie to you. Well, I mean, it's real though. I mean, I mean, 
When I say it, I was like, I have to turn the channel. I mean, I yeah, can't yeah. watch that shit. Yeah, yeah. No, don't get me wrong. It makes me sad, too. Listen, I got a heart. But I'm not just going to torture myself. <laughs> okay? Oh, no. I'm like, see, that's the thing. Like, I don't know where that money's actually going to. Have a good night there, Conoco. Thanks for stopping by. Have a Merry Christmas. And now that it is... Merry Christmas, Conoco. Especially Christmas Day now for Ray Rollins and Casey is Raw. Yay. Yeah. Conoco and probably TSS too. I don't exactly know where he, where he's from, but maybe it's Christmas Day for him. Uh, maybe. <laughs> I just want to say TSS is from California. I don't know why, man. TSS is from California somewhere. I just have that feeling. I just have that gut feeling. Yo, man, TSS, I'm supposed to watch Yu Yu Hakusho and finish it off. You know what? That week. that's an and anime like, I've been wanting to get into. But every time I tried to watch it, I just, I don't know, like, I just couldn't get into it. What? No He's... way. I don't know how, see, I get, the first few episodes are kind of, I would say weird in a sense, but it, it had, like, the logic of it, if you're looking at it through a uh, critical reviewer's lens, in the first couple episodes, you definitely can pick, you know, have some flaws to pick at it for. But if you just sit back and just watch it and enjoy, like a fan, I can't see how you can how you cannot get into it. I mean, it probably didn't help that the last time I tried to watch it, I watched a random episode back from when we oh, still oh, when we still had the Funimation TV channel on Verizon FiOS. Um, oh, they, wait, they had a TV channel? Yeah, Funimation had a TV channel on Verizon FiOS, oh, and shit. Uh, the last time the last time I tried to watch it. Um, they aired episode 175, and I sat there and watched it. I'm like, I don't know, this is cool, oh, but... Yeah. I mean, wait, wait, I, I, that's Yu Yu, that's Yu Yu Hakusho? Yeah. They aired episode 175, I'm like, okay, this is kind of cool, I guess, but, like, I don't know what's going on. I know it's, like, very late in the story, apparently, because of the episode number, but... See, it, it, see their series actually has... 112, like 112, 113 episodes, but I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna go off the wind here and say, like, you probably meant 75 or whatever, but, you no, know, it, the, I remember it said on TV, it said 175. Huh. Interesting. Or it might, it might because be I like, you know, I like some of those shonen anime, like, I love fucking no, Dragon Ball. I, I love it. I love Dragon Ball, I like Fairy Tale. I think that was a good show. Oh, I never got into I just watched the first episode of Fairy Tale, I just couldn't get into it. I yeah. know you need to give them, like, more than one episode, but I, I, I had a pass on that shit, man. Yeah, I My mean, brother loved it. the first, the first, I would say the first, like, the first, um, like, handful are definitely not that good. But once you get to, like, um, once you get to, like, where the first arc actually starts, which is on, uh, Moondrop Island, which is, I think, like, around episode 10, that's when okay. the show, that's when the show really starts to get good. Okay. So. And, and see, I, I've always been trying, I'll tell anyone who listen, man, Naruto is another one of the shows out there. Despite all its filler, I see you skip a good majority of the filler, but Naruto is another good show that people should check out. Only bad thing is, you gotta wait to... I mean, I really think you can get into it within, like, the first ten episodes. I sure did. So what, what do you think of Boruto, though, which is, like, the successor to Naruto? Um, well, I gotta correct you a little bit. It's Boruto. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, but honestly, I like it simply because I am a Naruto fan. Yeah, you can say it's more kiddie, it's more laid back. But, you know, I like the laid back version of Naruto. Like, I like seeing seeing um, episodes of him running around the Leaf Village, kicking it with um, Lee and Sasuke and all of them. I love shit like that. I love the Slice of Life episodes. But, um, I don't... See, I'm not a huge fan of, like, very serious episodes. Like, the, all the war shit, I'm not a fan of. Call me crazy, but I, I wasn't a huge fan of that. Like, I'm on episode 345, like, Shippuden. And I know how the story ends. I play the games. Like, that's all I need. So. And, um... Where am I in Boruto? So I want to say I'm at episode 45, where Shikadai meets that, um, that, um, vigilante kid. I forgot his name. I think he had, like, white hair or something, but I'm, I'm around that, I'm around that little arc right there. The bandits. And, um, I'm just waiting for them to come out with more dubbed episodes, which I think they did. I don't know which episode they're at now. But, Boruto, I love it. Simply because I'm a Naruto fan. A lot of people get shit on it, but I've always, I've listened. 
Naruto got me into the whole anime uh, anime universe. So I'm always like this. I got a special love for that series. <laughs> I'll give it a lot of leeway when it comes to reviewing it through a critical lens. Yeah, I, I don't really talk about anime too much because I only watch dubbed anime. And like I know like yeah. a lot of people watch it in, uh, in you know Japanese. But I'm like, you know what, man? Like, you know, because of my, the disability that I suffer with, it's like yeah. if, if I'm gonna wa if I'm gonna have to read the subtitles, I might as well just read the fucking manga. Exactly, exactly. So by the time I get to watch an anime, you know, everybody who's wanted to see it already seen it already. So what the hell am I gonna get to talk about? You know? Right. You know what's another good one out uh, even? If you love anime, you watch dub. You probably seen this, uh, My Hero Academia. Yeah, yep, yep. I watched. I think what was it? The first four seasons. I think that aired. Yep, yep. That, uh, they're coming out with season five. I want to see in the springtime. I haven't finished season four yet, but I know how the uh, manga's playing now and everything. So, but My Hero Academia is another uh, good new anime. And what about Black Clover? I haven't watched that one yet, but uh, I have drawn some uh, interest in that one. I seen the first sixteen episodes. It was all right. It was all right. And I mean, I haven't, I haven't seen another episode since probably, honestly, probably like last year sometime. Probably at the beginning of this. But I've always been wanting to get into it, man. And it's a weekly anime, so which kind of means that, that it's that, one of those anime where, where you have to wait a minute to get into it. So. Yeah, that that one's still airing on Toonami, I think, too. Uh, yeah, it is, it is, it is. What's another one? You, you hot the show, you've seen that. So you need to start an episode one with that, for sure. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, probably go back one day and try to watch that one. If you want, I got a good site where you can watch all that shit at, too. Oh That's yeah, I know, I know at. quite a few of them. That is, until they all start getting shut down because of that fucking, uh, that new law that got signed the other day. Man, I hope not. Don't say that. <laughs> uh, all right. I mean, fucking yeah. I'll, I'll I'll be fucking mad. Well, what they, though? They can't police all that shit though. They can't. What I'm hearing is that's for like the really. I, I'm gonna assume it's for like the people that like really doing some bad shit, like uh, like streaming movies and Ooh. stuff like that. Yeah, well, that's what these websites do. You know. Well, then the Sunday B. Uh, penalized for that? I mean, I mean we don't want we we as something... anime we as anime fans don't want that to happen. But you know, it's that's a that's a strong possibility now with this new law. Oh, well, well, I guess that's the, I mean, the end of uh, shit... Super Mario World Christmas uh, edition because the game crashed. That's great. <laughs> well, well, I mean, if you're doing something that's fair use, that's one thing. I think they shouldn't come after you if you're doing something fair use. But you're straight up like taking something and streaming it completely uh, un uh, untouched. I feel like like I can see where they're coming from, but... Just be careful how you word this, Casey, because some anime fans will eat you alive. They worship <laughs> some They worship some of these fucking websites. And let me tell you something, actually. Let me tell you something, actually. In 2012, uh, when I met yeah. Conoco, when I met Conoco on an anime site called uh, Just Dubs, I don't know, maybe you've heard of that one there, uh, Ray. Uh, I actually worked on that website. I was actually one of the anime suppliers for that website for a while. Get the fuck out of here, for real? Yeah, yep. Damn. Put it you this way. The, the anime, the, you, know the, you know how big the Pokemon anime is now? Yeah. Back in 2012, it was still considered like one of the biggest anime out there, one of the biggest dubbed anime. Uh, Nobody wanted to touch Pokemon. You know who did Pokemon? Who? I did. Why did they? What they didn't want to touch Pokemon? Because of wow. because there were so many episodes, and they didn't want to deal with. Um, there were so many episodes, they didn't want to deal with uh, uploading. You know, finding finding downloads for all of them. Uh, torrents and stuff, and having to upload all of those and code it to the website. No, none of the other uploaders wanted to deal with it, so I'm like, "Fuck you, I'll do it." <laughs> <laughs> I was responsible. I was responsible for that website for at the time, which was 
Uh, I think the newest series that was was out was I think um, I think uh, Gen Five and Pokemon, so like Black and White was just ending when I did okay. when when I did all of those. And mind you, I did all of the episodes, all of the short, all of the short films that were attached to the to the actual Pokemon movies, all of the freaking TV specials, all of the movies. I did, I can't tell you how many hours of Pokemon I uploaded for that website because nobody else wanted to do it. Listen, I hope they I hope they compensated you well, my son. No, I got fired because I couldn't, um, oh, me, and, me, and, me and one of the other uploaders didn't get along, and we fought a lot in, in, in like, uh, DMs and stuff, and I, I, drew, I brought attention to it of the, uh, the admin. But the admin was a fucking little bitch and didn't want to do anything about it. So then I wrote a nasty fucking, um... <laughs> I wrote a nasty fucking uh, Facebook uh, public, you know, post on Facebook, ranting mm. about it. And that's what led me to get fired. And I'm like, alright, you guys want to treat me like shit? So you know what I did? I got the website DMCA'd. And then that motherfucker, man... I said, you know what? I said, I said, you need to fear four letters, motherfucker. D M C A. <laughs> two months, two months after I wrote that letter, that I wrote that letter on Facebook, the website got D M C A. And that motherfucker tucked his tail between his legs and ran away. He ditched that fucking website and left it to and left the uh, and left it to fucking die uh, with all the other uh, people that were still trying to keep it afloat. <laughs> what hey, the fuck? Shut so, that shit down. I know so, that's right. So this hack is called the special Christmas. Wow. It looks like uh Drew uh got blocked from Joe. What the hell happened? It's Man, a it's like a work, dude. Yeah, I well, saw. Not not only that, but you're you're nine hours late, my man. Yeah. Oh I, really? I saw that earlier today. Mario's ready for that time of the year again, meeting up with his friends for an uh, annual Christmas party. All right. Oh my God! Frank took a picture of himself watching you guys uh, fighting. Did he? Oh <laughs> shit! Did he put? Where did he post it? On Twitter? It's on Twitter. Yeah. yeah oh, on Twitter. Shit. <laughs> I gotta look, I gotta look at that shit in a minute. You know what? I'm gonna go to his Twitter and I'll fucking put it on the stream. Is that all right, Frank? I'll, I'll fucking I'll fucking look at that at that tweet and I'll put it up on the screen. <laughs> well, it looked like uh, Ray already saw it and he retweeted it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's funny. Oh man, De after after that, man, I, we definitely got to get Drew to fucking play our uh, play our at least our last fight with you getting. Probably the worst beating out of all of the beatings you got. Oh, come on, man. Don't, you can't make me look that bad. <laughs> make me look something good. Play one of the cool wild fights, man. <laughs> <laughs> Play one of the they want to see a good fight. They don't want to see an ass whooping. All right. I'll, t I'll tell Drew to play the Raiden and Kung Lao fight. Uh, actually, you know, I, I, I mean, what, I, what I'll do is maybe I'll do like a highlight. I'll do like a highlight video of all the fights. And I'll, ha I'll have him play that, and then I'll be like, "Yeah, oh, yeah you, you want to see, you know, see the whole thing? I'm, you know, you gotta go to my channel to see the whole thing." Right. That's a good idea, actually. Oh Christ, man! What the Fucking hell? ice physics, man! I can't make this jump. Fucking ice physics. Ice physics in a Mario game is fucking should be criminalized. This can't be real with the KFC console. I don't think so. No. So, is that like a console with a KFC livery? I'm assuming. What it is, it says it's the world's first built in chicken chamber. Built in chicken chamber. Yeah, it what? looks like it looks like while you're playing your game, you can fry your own chicken. Oh, <laughs> hell no. <laughs> Casey would buy that like. up in a heartbeat. It says never risk letting your chicken go cold again. 
thanks to the patent chicken chamber. <laughs> you know what? That sounds like a that sounds like a PlayStation system that's that's gonna get a red screen of that. <laughs> hey, at least they didn't call it the chicken choker. Oh my! God. <laughs> it says it's using a core of i9 9th gen. I guess some kind of card. And they're showing some specs on it. Um, and it's gonna be V already. <laughs> man, you oh. know what, man? On that note, I need to give me some V. Cause I got me yo, I had the, I had this nice ass pizza man with um anchovies, bacon, and onions and ar- and garlic on it. Shit is fire. Ooh. I got a little bit of it left. I'm gonna go kill that bitch right now. I got me some cannolis in there too. I got me something sweet. I sure gotta take something sweet. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna get up out of here, man. I wanna wish every single one of you people. <laughs> Frank said I choked my chicken. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't, man. You got a wife. <laughs> you know people like me and Alex should be choking our chicken. <laughs> yeah, shit, I might do that after I get done motherfucking smashing. I might go to bed. I'm, I, I need to choke my chicken. But, uh, <laughs> listen, y'all. Merry Christmas to both y'all, Casey and, uh, and, and uh, Rose and everybody in the chat, man. I hope you guys have a good, safe holiday. Eat a lot, drink a lot, choke your chicken, all that good shit. <laughs> <laughs> I will see y'all when I see y'all, man. Peace out, Re- y'all. All right, Merry Ray, Christmas, thanks. Ray. Thanks for stopping Merry in. Merry y'all, too. And uh, I guess I'll talk to you guys again on Sunday. Or at least you, anyways. I don't know if Casey's going anywhere. <laughs> you running off, Casey, or are you staying? I'm staying for a little bit. Uh, okay. I'm just, I'm just tweeting out that whole thing with the KSC Council thing. <laughs> All right, y'all. Uh, I'll have the stream up in the background. Once again, Merry Christmas. And I'll see y'all when I see y'all. Peace Peace everybody, Merry Christmas. I cannot believe it. this thing can't be real. I got. I gotta. Go, I gotta go look at Frank's. Uh, I gotta go look at Frank's uh, tweet real quick. <laughs> uh, let me see. Hold on a minute. I gotta look at this thing here. Uh, let me just do. I sent the. Let's see. Screen share. That would be this one, right? No. Which one is the screen? The I don't know which one the Twitch uh, screen share is. Oh, fuck it, I'll just add a new layer. Uh, let me pull that up. I gotta see this fucking this reaction real quick. Uh, that's the KFC thing. I have to take. I'll take a look at that in a minute. Um, <laughs> here we go. Hey, have you seen this one console? It it's a shape of a boob. No. It's been a long time ago. I had to try to look it up. I don't know if you can actually still buy this thing. So here's Frank's uh, here's Frank's reaction to us playing Mortal Kombat. Uh, I don't know if he's yawning or if he's amazed at what he was seeing. Uh, but here it is. <laughs> Looks like he's ready to take a dick in his mouth. <laughs> uh, yeah, I-, I hope we weren't putting you to sleep there, uh, uh, Frank. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, there it is, man. There it is. Let's get back to uh, get back to the and game. I'll, and I'll send this one to you too. Oh, hold on. No, under that retweet. I was sexually excited, he said. <laughs> God damn it, just dropped my phone. Oh, man. I said about the... Uh, about the boob console. Yeah, I'll take a look at that stuff later. I don't want to interrupt my stream too much here. <laughs> I got eight levels of hell to play, and I just beat the first one. Uh, oh, boy. Look at this fucking dick clam abuse right here, man. This is ass.
what not to do in a ROM hack. I love this guy's play. It's football. Yes, Chuck. It's football season. Oop. Oh shit! Oh fuck! I think that's over. How the fuck am I supposed? Oh, you know what? I bet you I need to keep that mushroom. Yeah, if you have to keep the mushroom, that's gonna be fucking great. Oh, there we go. Oh, almost. Come on. Come on. There you go. Up and over. Fuck it. I frame it. I frame it. I frame it. Uh, th this is why safe states were invented. For shit Good like this. It's like a glitch. This is why safe states were invented. For this kind of bullshit. Oh, fuck, I landed there too. Alright. This this rock this ROM hack was classified as very hard. And yeah, I could see why. <laughs> oh oh sh Oh that that football was fucking perfectly placed. <laughs> I might have to call this one quits, man. This is fucking hard. Oh, I see why. Stick your football <laughs> up your ass. Responding in that same spot to keep dying. Oh, okay. oh, oh. Yeah, that's gotta be some kind of gag with the KSC. Uh. That's not the first time I've heard of that console, though. No, I agree. Uh, that's not the first time, but now that uh, you, I've been Chuck, hearing it the last, shit. I've Asshole. been hearing it the last couple days on YouTube. Yes. And especially the the look of the console is the same as the first time I've seen that around, where it's in like a. It looks like a black cooker with the the top part is where you fry your, or keep either keep your chicken uh, hot or fries your chicken, and then you, I guess you play your games digitally. And then after you eat your chicken, you can choke the other one. <laughs> So, um, so hopefully your chicken's not too greasy. So if you're gonna play uh, games on it, your controller won't be all greasy. Ooh, boy, holy! Oh, you bitch! All right, I got this. I got this. I don't. Oh, I got this. All right. Um, what do I gotta do here? Right, timing is key. Yeah, Fuck it, I win. I couldn't, I couldn't, uh, compete with you guys on Portal Combat. I'm like, fuck that. I want to see, I want to know if Ray plays like Soul Calibur and stuff. I'd be interested to play that with him. Now, Soul Calibur, I'm not nearly as good, so you might have a more, you might have more of a fighting chance than that one. Oh, man. I was wondering, uh, Frank said he was thinking about playing some Fortnite. I was thinking to join, say he wants to join to do that, but I'm kind of starting to get a little tired that I'm almost ready to go to bed. Yeah, man, you, you know, you gotta get ready for the, the festivities, to, you know. Festivities? The Christmas no, festivities. really, there's nothing for. I, uh, all I really need to do is. is uh, Christmas wrap my stuff. Yeah, Frank says he's out gas himself, so. Alright, yeah, well, you just kinda... have a good night. Well, I ain't leaving just yet. Well, you made it sound like you were. Yeah, true, but good point. Dude, this is fucked. 
He says after dinner he's gonna go watch Wonder Woman. Is the new one out? <laughs> yeah, this looks extremely ass hard. It is. Fuck. Good lord. This is. Oh, it comes out tomorrow. Oh yeah, yeah, the Wonder Woman 1984 movie. What's the point? What's with the 1984 part? I mean, so this is back in the past now. I have no idea why they're calling it that, to be honest. Oh, 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 bitch. God, this... Wee. Yeah, it says it takes place in 84, so I'm like... Mm. Wonder you why... get pissed off at a video game, watch me play something like this. <laughs> oh, That's I funny. fucking had it too. <laughs> yeah, he he caught that ledge. I keep I can catch the ledge, but I keep fucking I keep hitting the dick clamp. Oh, and then he do get it, and then he get. <laughs> oh, the fucking ice transit. Oh, yeah, I call them dick clamps. Fuck you, Chuck. Oh my god, I made it. Oh! No! <laughs> ah! Safe! <laughs> oh, here we go again. Oh! Ooh, almost had that in the first shot. Uh, Alright, that went too- Oh, spoke too soon. I wanted to be on Frank's show, to, uh, but it sucked that I totally forgot what timing, uh, because I wouldn't mind have done the Christmas movies with him. Yeah, I was so busy, I didn't even get a chance to tune in. I just saw that it was him, him Garguts, Cora, uh, him, Garguts, it, Cora, and uh, Jeremy were on. I saw that so on Discord when I was posting my show. So he pretty much had enough people there anyways. I mean, you don't want too many people, or... I mean, like it happens on the rail sometimes where there's too many people on there and you can't get a word in edgewise. Yeah, that's one of the that's one of the reasons I don't come on every week, but... I'm definitely gonna come on the, uh, post... The, uh, the post-Christmas show. Yeah, uh, I'm sure it's gonna be fun time. I... I want... Today's still Thursday. God, well, I mean, technically it's Friday now, but... Because I was off today, it feels like Saturday. Up and over, baby. There we go. Oh, dick clam right at the end of the slide. That's, that's a troll. <laughs> Fucking dick clams. Oh, talk about troll. I should... I've been needing to transfer some of my Mario Maker games from the Wii U and transfer it over to the Switch. I need to do that. Oh, well, I hope you um, hope you enjoy the movie, Frank. Maybe uh, maybe on Sunday you could do like a mini review of it. At least like your first uh, your first impressions of the movie, I guess. Maybe and you could do like a and more. You could save like a more you know, thought out review for your show. I didn't get to watch your show. Um, what, what, what topics are you going to do for next week for the New Year's Eve special? Or are you going to do like a 2020 uh, year in wrap up or whatever? That's a good question. I was actually thinking about doing that with you with games there, Casey, uh, next uh, Thursday. We can do that. We do a 2020 year in uh, review with. Uh, Best and worst, best and worst games of 2020. Frank says he'll do a quick review when he gets back in the car. That's cool. I mean, I'm not planning to go watch it. I was not. Uh, I did not enjoy the first one. 
Brian actually also watched a bootleg version that didn't help watching in Chinese lettering. <laughs> it threw me off, but I did not like it. Anyways. Oh, I almost fucking had it, man. This is like fucking Kaizo fucking to the max, man. <laughs> I don't play Kaizo hacks, and now you know why. You know, it's funny. Well, I'm sure you know about all the bootleg DVDs being in, like, New York and New probably in New Jersey or Pennsylvania. Bootlegs of what? I, I know uh, when I moved to Pennsylvania, my father-in-law uh, worked in New York. So right. he would get a bunch of bootleg movies. <laughs> Like the ones that are still in the theater. Oh yeah, my my dad used to uh, go to a gas station to get bootleg movies all the time. See, that's the thing is in Oklahoma, that's you don't see that anywhere. In Pennsylvania, or you might see it in somewhere in Pennsylvania, but it's easily spotted in New York. Right. Well, New York is like the fucking, I wouldn't say the crime capital of the world, but it's certainly one of them. Yeah, that's true. I would say definitely that it's inside the top three. Ooh, I didn't think I was going to make that jump. Mm. Man, this game is making me clench my ass cheek, my freaking ass cheek on <laughs> more than one occasion. <laughs> You know what? I, if we're not doing anything, we could do something like that, in, like uh, this weekend. You know what I mean? I was thinking I mean, saving it for New Year's uh, New Year's Day or New Year's Eve. We could do it like a, a countdown to uh, a countdown to New Year's Day. Well, the problem is New Year's Day or Eve. I'm gonna be at family's house. I mean, unless oh, okay. we're gonna. So that's what I was thinking this weekend it would probably be great because I mean it's close enough anyways. Yeah, okay, maybe s not Sunday. Well, you like to go out video game hunting and stuff on Saturday, so I don't know. Well, I, I just went out. around. There's nothing out there. I'm thinking Saturday or Sunday to go get something for the kids. I'll probably see if I can get the girlfriend to help me find something for my uh, sister's kids. And maybe get a man gift for, uh, I do it at my dad's side of the family, um, we do the Dirty Santa. Dirty Santa? Yeah. Never heard of that in my life. What? You, you don't, you never heard of Dirty Santa? No. What you do is that you put the, mostly it's, um, you put a bunch of gifts in the in a pile, and then you draw out uh, what number you're gonna be. And the first person chooses out a uh, a present, and they open it. And then the second person oh, get comes up, and uh, Frank's taking off. Have a good night, Frank. Have a good night, Frank. Merry Christmas. Enjoy the movie. And I'll uh, talk to you guys on Sunday. Should be a pretty good derail. Yes, hopefully. But yeah, the second person gets to, to choose either to steal that present or pull another present out in the pile. Yeah, I've and, never uh, heard of that. Ever. And the present can be stolen twice. By the time it's stolen twice, it's locked. And sometimes we'll throw in to let the either the uh, no, we'll let the first person get another chance because I mean, if the person's got a shit present and that's it, I mean they kind of got fucked, you know? Yeah. Because you really want to be like the last person. At first, I thought you want to be the first person, but no, you really want to try to be the at the very end or somewhere by the end. 
You don't want to vary it because some of the gifts are being already locked down. So you want between like half to three quarters at the end. Yeah, I have never heard but that. Usually, but usually I go for tools and stuff like that. If I see wrenches work, or right? yeah, I would just you know I just aim for that. But I was thinking that be trying to pull like a gag gift, like put something stupid in there and then put something real beside it. <laughs> like uh, you ever watch the uh, good myth mythical morning with Lincoln Wreck? Uh, no. Well, uh, it's a good, they're good YouTubers. Um, they were doing, th they were showing two items that wrapped up. It one's real and one is fake. And like someone takes uh, one of the funniest ones is that they took like a corn cob with a uh, pair of pliers and a milk carton and made it look like a drill. Huh. That's unique. So I want to do something like that. It'd be funny, you know? Oh, I pick out a drill. And then they find out it's just a gag gif, you know? Yeah. Or I could get like a children's, uh, a fake drill or like a toy drill. They're like, oh, let me get a tool. A a tool, and then it's like, nope, it's a toy. <laughs> Just to fuck with them, you know? <laughs> I think last year, I got, uh, lottery tickets. I think I got, like, made, I think I got, like, 80 bucks, I think, last. So I was like, yeah, I'm happy with that. Oh, excuse me. COVID. Uh. Hold on, is it in New York? They don't have a Walmart in New York. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's a Walmart in New York City. Oh, I don't even think there's any in New York at all, isn't it? I think, yeah, there's some, be wrong? there's some in, like, upstate New York, but not in the city. Oh, okay. Uh, in the city, they don't. Okay. Well, I mean, who cares if they don't have it in the city? You know? They already have so much stuff in the city. Oh, almost made that on my first job, my first try. Oh, I hammer <laughs> right up the ass. Good God, how could you play this? Very patiently. Oh, that was... I call bullshit on a couple of those deaths. Because... If you land on the handle of a hammer, I mean, you shouldn't die from that. Mario logic, Casey. Come on now. <laughs> it's like, how did you die? I died on a uh, handle of a hammer. There we go. You know, it looks like those Koopas, those flying Koopas, looks like they're from, uh, God, from the Wacky World, uh, game. Well, I think they have, uh, I think they have fucking, uh, Christmas hats on. It just looked like something from the, the Wacky World. Uh, that unreleased game for the Philips CDI. Yeah. Hey, did you hear Mike Matei's leaving Cinemasker? Yeah, I watched uh, James's update video about that the other day. 
After, I was shocked about that. After like 15 years, dude, he's leaving. Well, I mean, life it moves on, and I know that Mike Mate is doing more of his own streams, you know? He wants to focus on his, uh... He wants to focus on his, uh, Twitch channel. You know, and then... He's put enough time in, and he should do whatever he wants, I mean... Someone, a bunch of people think there's a bunch of bullshit happened to, for him to leave. Because, I mean, especially they said that uh, the guitar guy left a while ago, and, um... Oh, uh, what's his name, uh... What the fuck's his name? It's not Kyle, is it? No. Yeah, it's Kyle. Oh, is it... Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, Kyle, but his song, his music is still there, so if if you think there's uh, bad blood, wouldn't he want the, not that song to be there no more? Uh, I mean, maybe. Unless he really paid for that, for, like, if James paid for that song. But, uh... And Bootsy left, so they're like, well, all the new guys are leaving. Yeah, I mean, all the old guys are leaving. Well, that's because fucking Screenwave when came in and, like, changed so much stuff about the channel. You know, some people weren't happy about it. Yeah, but I just don't think, uh, there was... I could be naive. I'm just hoping there wasn't really no bad blood, you know? Yeah, that'd be a shame I mean, for all their fucking friendships to fucking go to waste after all these years. Yeah. I mean, Bootsy, I mean, Bootsy I, was the first one to leave, I think. Yeah, I agree. But Kyle wasn't there. Uh, Kyle wasn't doing too many shows anyways, you know? But Bootsy only really did, like, uh, the board game stuff. Yeah, I think he did one episode. Uh, one or two episodes. Uh, oh, I think I've seen them do a couple of James and Mike Monday. And that sucks. That was a staple for a long time. Yep. Of them playing the game every week. But I think that's something we should definitely talk about um, too, you know, about Mike Bute leaving. That's a good news topic about video games related something. Yeah, it's definitely. Uh, I mean, Jay, Mike did a lot to help the channel. He he helped. Oh, yeah. He helped write some of the episodes. Did the artwork? Yeah, he did a lot of the art, the title cards and stuff. Yeah. He was almost there from, no, I wouldn't say day one, but I think after episode three or four, he f showed up. And because of uh, Angry Radio Game Nerd, I got into watching the Game Chasers, and then not only that, um, Pat the NES Punk, and a bunch of those guys, too. Yeah, I started watching uh, Pat because of the nerd. Yeah, and then what the, was the irate? Uh, game her. That guy just straight up stole his content. Yeah, he had some other things, but he pretty much stole James' content. I wouldn't say he stole it, but he definitely copied him quite a bit. Yeah. Oh, that's what I mean. It was plagiarism. 
I mean, honestly, there's gonna be some games that um, people are gonna overlap, but when there's some blatantly uh, copy stuff, that's why no one took his ass serious, you know? Yeah. Please be the end of the level. Yes. I got one more level in this fucking godforsaken nightmare of a fucking game. <laughs> then I could go on to a different Christmas game. A different Christmas ROM hack. I think right after that, uh, this one, I'll tap out for the night. Uh, hey, you gotta hear me rage one more time, Casey. Oh, what the <laughs> fuck? What the fuck is this shit? There you go, is that it right there? I get a hundred seconds to do this level? You fucking suck my cock in a hundred seconds, how about that? Well, that means the level should be short, then. I don't know if it means it's gonna be short, but... Well, it's gotta be if it's under a hundred seconds. Oh, I had to fucking... <laughs> Wait for him to stop throwing baseballs. There we go. Yeah. This makes me want to go back and... You. Re uh, remaster some of my old troll levels. And then send them to you. Well, you see it, Casey. I'm getting through this. Yeah. Piece by piece. Hey, I'm cheating. Um, According to Ray, um, I'm cheating, but I'm getting it done. Uh, I mean, that's what I was saying. Uh, what is considered cheating? I'm like, if you, they supply you uh, the features, is it technically now cheating? Oh, dude, I got fucking bullets, too. Oh, I ran out of fucking time. Are you serious? <laughs> I can't do that in a hundred seconds. Fuck you. You can kiss my ass in a hundred seconds. I'm done. Fuck I, that hack. I'm actually, done. technically, that's one uh, long kiss. Yeah. Kissing someone's ass for a hundred seconds. I am not doing that again. No. <laughs> I, I am not torturing myself to finish that hack. Absolutely not. Absolutely. Absolutely fucking not. Is this like DOS you're on? No, it's uh, ZSNES. Oh. It looks like some old school look on the computer. Oh, fuck me sideways. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh shit! You got a problem? <laughs> What's your problem? I don't Damn. have. Oh wait, no. What is this? Uh, I don't. I accidentally uh, copied over the original file, so I can't patch the next one. <laughs> that, that was fucking real smart of me. Unless... Let me try something. What is this? Let me try one thing. You ever watch the Tourette's guy? What do you mean by Tourette's guy? There's a YouTuber called Tourette's guy. Oh, then uh, I had to say no. Oh, uh, you gotta watch it. Well, this guy's been on the YouTuber for ever. Pretty much, as, I'm gonna say, probably since YouTube was a thing. Right. And he just put something else out. Saying Tourette's guy buried alive, and it looks like he's buried alive in the, a room full of can of soda cans. 
Jesus. So, yeah, you know, I got to pee, then I'm going to hit the hay. All right, man. Well, thanks for coming by the stream for a while. Uh, hope you enjoyed the. It, uh, hope you enjoyed the fights uh, tonight. It, it was fun. We definitely. Uh, if we're not gonna do the streaming this weekend, we'll try to get together and try to figure out what the hell is going on with my setup. I probably like what you're saying. I pr I probably had to get the Elgato. Elgato. I, I mean, if anything, I mean, I guess it'll be one other thing, one less thing to have to worry about if I get the Elgato, you know? Yeah. But, yeah, the Elgato's kind of expensive if you get the one that I have, so. Well, I mean, I still have some money on the card that I could go get it and not have to worry about it. But I was trying to set, save this card to pay for the PlayStation 5. Right. I mean, hey, you know... Do what you want to do, man. Well, I mean, I want to get it going because I could uh, want to play a bunch of games on different systems. I don't want to just have to rely on the PlayStation 4. You know what I mean? Yeah. Or the Xbox. I want to play my Switch. I want to play my Wii U. I want to play these other systems. But... We'll, we'll work on it. But I'll talk to you later. I'm going to go pee and go to bed. All right, bro. Have a good All night. Right. All right. Talk to you later, buddy. All you right. have a good Christmas. You too, man. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, bro. All right. Good night. Good night.